We've been going to Labadee since 1985 and it started out as a tender port where the ship would pull up, drop anchor, and we would tender the guests back and forth. Now we have a pier. We have three dining facilities for the guests, so it's evolved into a private port that offers almost everything that you can imagine. As you see, we have the new slide, which is fantastic being a permanent structure. Our old slide was inflatable. It's very nice, 40 feet in the air, but this one is much nicer. We've got a nice view from there and it's longer. When the engineers came, they worked around the natural topography and made it what it is. So that area is great for families. You've got the aqua park right there as well. And it's inflatable toys, they're all anchored to the bottom. So they get in, they have a life jacket on, they can jump on the trampoline, they can climb the icebergs and jump off. And basically it's great for kids. The coast is very cool, it's like a little cart. And basically it's run by gravity. You can see the whole bay, the ship, everything. So you come down and depending on how game you are, it depends on how much brake you use. There are people that will not brake and get all the way to the bottom. We have the zip line, which is the longest zip line over the water in the world. It's about half a mile long. It's amazing, it's gorgeous. We call it that. Dragon's Flight Line. It's fabulous. The view again is amazing. Even people that are afraid of heights that do it, love it. We have folkloric dance troupes performing on a regular basis. We have an artisan's market, an authentic straw market, wave runners, parasailing, you name it. Over the years, we've kept adding different attractions to the site. You can relax, you can use one of the cabanas and get weighted on hand and foot by one of the cabana attendants, or you can be as active as you want to be. You've got your own private space, and then you can leave everything here. You can go and do activities. I think it's kind of the quintessential Caribbean destination. I think when people think about going to the Caribbean, this is probably what they envision in their minds. You know, cabanas on the beach, palm trees, all those, those good things that you'd expect to find in a Caribbean destination.